Hi everyone, so it's technically even, evening? Evening on Christmas day, but I just wanted to quickly come on here and just show you guys what I got for Christmas. Um, Cause I know quite a few of you liked what I got for my birthday and obviously in no way am I bragging or anything like that. I was extremely spoilt this year. Christmas isn't just about giving presents. Like it was so nice to have like my mum and sister here. Um, my dad didn't feel well, so he didn't come. Um, so yeah, if I show you what I got, first off, I'm gonna start off with Bernard. He got me a trip to Poland, so we're going next year for three nights. I'm not going to say when, obviously. Um, so yeah, I'm excited to start travelling again because we haven't, well, when I say we, even on my boyfriend, but me and Sprout haven't obviously gone on any holiday since 2020. And I've only been to Prague and Ireland with Bernard as well, so it'd be nice to start travelling places with him. So that's what he got me. If I start with what Sprout got me, I need to go downstairs and find all the other stuff as well because... Um, just to show like the odd bit so like i did get a lot of vouchers from people which i prefer because i never really know what i want when it comes around to christmas so i normally just love vouchers because then i can just go and spend and buy what i want and then sprout got me like a whole bag of chocolate as well but anyway so she got me a little bath pillow that was from tk maxx because actually there when she bought it i won't like open it and show you all but you guys know i love like my little 50p coins that i collect um obviously i want to save them in the future when some of them become rare and things like that so I've started off with like, oh, it's upside down. Sprout started off a subscription for the Harry Potter ones. So I've got all the coloured ones of like Hermione, Ron, Harry. And then I've got another two Hogwarts ones. I've got a whole like little Tinkerbell set. I've got an Eeyore, which I was there for because we bought like the Royal Mint in Wales. And then she's got me a little Robin one because obviously I love Robins. And I think, as I said before, like the worst part of like Christmas and birthdays is putting everything away and finding a home for things. Um, and then just like things like deodorant and that. Honestly, I need, like, as an adult, you appreciate things like that because then you don't have to buy them. I've got some Cheshire Cat socks from Sprout. Oh, them deodorants are from my mum. got a Grinch highlighter from Sprout, some transparent powder. i got a red eyeliner. And then she got me my favourite, like, bubble bath. It's a Harry Potter one. It's from Boots. And I think she gave me one that she was gifted last year and i absolutely loved it i don't know what it was i just really loved the smell so yeah i wanted another one of them and then of course i had to get another peter pan bag because i cannot resist like lounge fly bags would be an addiction if i had a big house i was rich i'd have them all up on the wall so i got this one skull rock and then i'm not gonna take it out of its wrapping paper because i'll just keep it like that so it keeps it a bit more safer then she got me some hot hot Hocus Pocus tea towels, which I was actually there for. They were from TK Maxx and they're like £10 or 11 And then... She got me a little Calvin Klein set because honestly, I would say my sets are getting smaller, but obviously I'm just getting bigger. <laughs> so I need some bigger ones. And then I will take these out actually because... No, I'll keep them in there. So I've got a Harry... Um, oh God, I really can't speak. A Peter Pan purse. Love that. And then... I might take this one out so I can show you guys because it's actually like covered in tissue paper. I've really got like an obsession with Wizard of Oz at the moment, like some of the merch. That's so nice. So I've got a Wizard of Oz one, which I'll put back in the paper. I was sorting out my bags and purses the other day and I honestly don't know where I'm going to put this stuff. Like I've got another bag to show you guys. It's so bad. And obviously I've just bought that guess one. Oh, that's not going back in. We'll leave that out. I got the Psychedelic circus palette from jeffree star cosmetics honestly i just love like his brand um like the packaging the quality like it's affordable as well um like i can't fault any of his products like i absolutely love them and i really loved my jawbreaker palette which was multicolored. so i wanted this one because it would follow on suit from that like so i'm not going to use this yet she got me this crazy cat lady um lint roller and then i got some t liquid um Eyeshadows, but from Jeffree Star Psychedelic Circus Collection. But I'm gonna try and use them as like a liquid eyeliner. The problem is, I've asked for some facial products. Um, obviously, not knowing I would be having like a whole skincare routine, but I will keep these and obviously I will use them once I finish these products. So I've got um, the Noraderm Phyto Solution, that's a cleanser, and then she got me um, a mask. So yeah, hopefully, I can start using them in like a couple months' time. She got me the Beyonce Wild Orchid perfume and I like this because it will match like when one of the perfumes run out I can use this and it will match with my little pink thing but it also smells really nice as well. I'm not buying any perfumes that smell nasty but yeah a little pink bottle. You guys might find this cool but I've got her to get me another doormat that I'm going to put by for next year. Freddy Krueger! 
Halloween. And then I absolutely love this. I didn't think it was gonna be as big as it is. Look how stunning that is. This sold out so quick and within right. Trouble brewing, little binks. It's just a little Halloween candy pop. So I've got some Halloween stuff that I need to put by for next year. So Sprout did get me some vouchers and I'll show you the bits downstairs that she got me. In the meantime, my mum got me um, a grey hoodie. Now I've got two black ones and a pink one of this from Matalan. And I love them, they're so like nice and cosy and oversized for the gym. And then she got me some new Lululemon Black Align, 25 inch. And then I love this jacket because I've only got like khaki, white, cream, no not white, cream, grey and black. And I thought this was a really nice colour. It's like nice like purpley type colour. So this is from Next, it was £24. So yeah, that's nice. It's quite thin, but it will keep me warm like when it warms up a bit. Ra's mum got me a voucher. I've got a lot of like vouchers for um, TK Maxx. I actually got free, but I absolutely love it in there. I'm always in there. Oh, let me show you my little new collection to my Disney stuff. This bad boy. I don't normally collect like the UNESCO Disney showcase um, stuff, but like I just couldn't resist it. It was so nice and like glittery and stuff. Here's little Mabel. Pumpkin is still sitting out here. Are you not bored? Are you not bored? <laughs> right, and then Sprout also got me the Gossip Girl series because it's like one of my fave. She also got me Lucifer because that is top fave. That is second favorite after Smallville. Mary Kate and Ashley to grandmother's house we go. Like I'm building their collection up because as a kid, I absolutely loved Mary Kate and Ashley. I loved all their films, so little time. I read all the books. I just absolutely loved them. Um, and then as a <laughs> random one, she got me this, the Jacqueline Wilson collection. If you're from the UK and you've watched this, oh my God, that's a throwback, man. Um, because that was actually mine that she kept because what we did is, because she had so many DVDs, we had to take them out of the cases and put them in like a big box. Um, and that was the only way it fit. So that was everything I got. And then I also got a nice little DVD player because I don't have one because Bernard's parents left one and it was broken um, or partially broken. So we just got rid of it and like, get a new one. So now I can start watching all my stuff. I also got three candles, two reed diffusers and then Sprout also gave me a reed, reed diffuser. Oh, and then she got me, I've got like these olive like, um, salt and pepper pot so she, we found these and it gives like the Italian olive vibe so she got me the coasters and the matching placemats I've got a ridiculous amount of chocolate from Sprout and then my mum gave me them so yeah I'm stocked up and then the babies got treated by Nanny Bear and um, they got some treats like a new feather catcher thing and then they love this guys so you put it on the floor you press the button I won't do it because they're like chilled now um, you put it on the floor and it moves around and then it spins and obviously it's got a feather on and they love feathers so like they try and chase it and stuff it's so funny I'm gonna have to hide that actually because they will probably try and get it in the night I think that was everything I got if anything there's only a few other little bits but I don't, I didn't really want to vlog on Christmas day, but while I was putting everything away, I thought, oh, I better show you guys now, because when it comes to me vlogging after Christmas, I'm not going to remember what I got. Everything's going to be put away, so I thought it would just be easier. Yeah, I'm trying to tidy up now. I will probably try and vlog maybe every day, like, and do a weekly vlog. Probably try and vlog maybe every day, like, and do a weekly vlog. But tomorrow we're off to Bernard's sister's for Boxing Day, so I won't be able to vlog for most of the day then anyway. And I kind of want to, because I'm going to do makeup and hair and stuff, I kind of want to um, film like my Yeti haul so I can get that up and edited for Wednesday. I think I'm getting ill, guys, because Bernard's being ill. And then on Tuesday, I'm going lakeside with mum and sister. And then the only other plans I have is Sprout is coming to stay on New Year's Eve. But I'm probably, like I said, going to make this whole weekly vlog, so you guys won't know the plans until it goes live. So yeah, I'm going to put everything away now. Me and Bernard are going to have some chill time. And then it's bedtime because we didn't go to bed till late yesterday. But yeah, we had a really good day. I hope you all had a lovely Christmas as well. And obviously, and really nice New Year's when this goes live. And yeah, I'll catch up with you guys tomorrow, hopefully. Good morning, guys. So I haven't vlogged for a couple of days now just because I wanted to take some time off because obviously I've been vlogging like the whole of December. And 
Boxing Day I didn't really have much to show you I just wanted to show you guys what I was wearing but I didn't end up doing that and then yesterday I didn't really do much well I'd say I didn't do much of course I did I went out with mum and Sprout to Lakeside but I just wanted like a chill day no vlogging spend some time with them um, but I just wanted to come on here and show you guys what I bought yesterday I didn't actually buy as much as I thought I was gonna do and the sales like weren't even that good to be fair so yeah but I have put some makeup on today because I'm going to do a lot of filming. I need to film my Yitty haul. I want to do some get ready with me. So I want to do some photos. I've got my skims haul coming. So I will show you guys that on here because I'm not going to do a separate video because it's not really. Well, I suppose I could. I'll see. But I was going to do more like a TikTok review and a YouTube short rather than a video because I don't really have like tons to show you. So I might do that instead. But then I'll show you guys on here. I've also got another parcel coming today. I can't remember what it was now. Who's coming by DPD? I've got another parcel coming anyways. Hopefully I've got one from coming from Royal Mail, but I haven't actually had a dispatched email, so I've had to email them. So yeah, I just wanted to give you a skin update. So it was clearing up and then it broke out again. This side is a bit more clearer. But what I will say is since I've got like a proper skin routine, my makeup has applied so nicely. I think because obviously I'm moisturising my skin morning and night now, whereas I was really lazy. Sometimes I would just do it at night if or like not at all. Um, so yeah, it is applying really nicely. I do feel like my skin texture is a lot better. My skin feels brighter. But yeah, just for the breakouts, I'm not noticing a ton of difference yet. But obviously I know it's more on the inside rather than the outside. But the skin routine is really making my skin nice, so I'm happy about that. Obviously, I've only been doing it for a week now, and I've seen a difference already. So, the first thing I picked up is this Winter Peach Marshmallow Body Cream from Bath & Body Works. This is in Next. It was £8, but I can't tell you anything else more than that. And then, you'll probably remember these from my birthday video, but Sprout bought me these slippers, and I love them so much. They had one size five to six left and they were originally 22 and they were half price for 11 pounds so i snapped them up because they're really like good quality they're really thick sole base and i will probably use them for see how like the kittens are with them because i don't want them to trash my slippers you know um so yeah that was all from next and then all i've got is stuff from primark and there's not a lot but you guys know i am obsessed with these sets soon as i saw this color this is definitely more me this is more my type of green if you know you know so yeah that was seven pounds and then i picked up this in the sale as well primark had a lot on sale my mum was like oh they're not gonna have much blah blah but they had tons of stuff um so yeah i picked up this little like cropped jacket it was seven pounds from i think it was like 15 yeah um i got size 16 it's only like a tiny bit snug so an 18 probably would have fitted better, but yeah, I really like this. It's so cute, it's nice and cropped, um, and it's just thin and lightweight. And then I picked up these socks because obviously I can wear them with my boots for like when I wear pink, and then a cream pair will always come in handy. And they were four pound, which is like pricey for Primark, but they're so soft. And then I got these pillowcases in the sale for two pounds instead of 3.50, you'll see why in a sec. The brush pillowcases again, you know I love that. And then I bought this uh, brushed cotton duvet in the sale. I'm not like in love with the design, but they didn't have like much to choose from. And this one will match our room more because it is cream and it's got um, red and green on and um, a bit of brown. So I feel like I could use this all year round or especially like in the winter when it's cold. It's not like too Christmassy, whereas my Robin one is more Christmas vibes. So yeah, that was £10 from, well, it was 20 I think. Let me double check. Yeah, so it was 20 and it was half price. So yeah, I picked that up and that's pretty much all I got. Like I said, there wasn't tons. I also forgot to bring all my vouchers as well, which was annoying, but is what it is. I didn't spend much, like I said. And then we had Wimpy and then I just came home and chilled. I've been watching um, Mary Kate and Ashley films, the old school films. They're such classics. I used to love them growing up. So I watched To Grandmother's House We Go and Passport to Paris. So I'm going to do another one today. Hopefully finish some episodes of Raising Canaan with Bernard. He's just popped out to look at cars with his dad. Um, so yeah, I'm going to get ready now and film my video because I need to get moving because I've got a lot to do and I'll catch up with you guys. Maybe as I'm filming, I'll show you some like sneak peeks maybe. So I'm just finished filming the Yitty review and I had to show you guys this because this is the like raunchy out there piece. It was on the website and I was like, what the hell is that? I have to try it. And yeah, like I would never wear this. I don't really understand the use. Is it just for like a nice sexy evening with you and your man? I don't know, but 
yeah, that's not for me. So I need to finish tidying all this up, take some pictures and then... Right, Bernard has just got to me KFC that I've just finished because I literally haven't had anything today. We've got no bread. The cereal that we have is stale. So I need to balance this up on something. So yeah, I was not going to have KFC. So I've just filmed some Get Ready With Me. I've done my Fabletics or Yitty, should I say. Pumpkin, what's in the box? What's in the box? So I've got delivery. I'm hoping it's my Paris Hilton perfumes I told you guys about. So let's open it and find out. Ooh, it's definitely the fragrance, we saw it. Ooh, they come in like well big boxes. Oh, so cute. It's like a, what do you call them? What's the rectangle, oblong rectangle, whatever it is. I don't know, it's a weird shape. So I've got the platinum rush one. I've got the pink rush one. And then I got the gold rush, like purely for the packaging alone. I don't even want to take them out. They are so pretty. So I'm going to send Sprout a snap. But I'll show you guys what the bottles look like if you don't know. But also I did get them to kind of go on display anyway. So really, I should stop being silly because I can buy them again. Oh no, I just picked off the thingy, my bob. Ooh. So this is what I meant by like the, the little dresses. I was about to say, is there anything in there? Yeah, it's filled to the top. So it's got like textured glittered on, glitter on the outside. It's just a little dress. I don't want to use them, but I can't smell what it smells like. I just went off of reviews. Like I've never bought perfume online that I haven't smelled before, but I just, like I said, I liked them for the packaging. There was like a rose gold one, but I wasn't going to buy that just because it had rose in. And I don't like any rose or lavender smell. Oh, pretty. It's kind of given like that blue tingy vibe. I don't actually know why I got the gold. I think it was highly reviewed. Ooh, saucy, saucy. That's what that one looks like. Whoa. So once I've tidied my room and I've finished doing all my filming and that, I'll probably restyle my perfumes and show you guys the before and after because I did get like a little mini Beyonce heat one that was pink to go. I'm going to take a little picture of those. So yeah, I will show you guys when I'm reorganising in a bit. Oh, guys, it's been manic. My... Skims parcel has turned up, so I just tried all that on and realised I was supposed to show you guys and forgot. And now my Amazon parcels have just turned up, so I thought I would just show you guys what what I picked up anyway. Um, and then maybe as I film tomorrow, I'll show you guys the skim stuff like on. Um, because I'm going to do, like I said, a little like TikTok review or like a YouTube short. So I have the... Um, what do you call it? The, the square neck one, like with the fin straps like this. I have two of those in black, nude and pink. And then I got a short sleeved um, bodysuit. And then I wanted the long sleeve because obviously in winter it gives like a bit more layerage on my arm, coverage on my arms is what I mean to say. Um, and it is like a little fong style. So I got that in a 1X. It's super stretchy. I absolutely love them. I live in all my other ones. So that one was just needed, like I said, just so it covers my arms more. And then I picked up some of the stuff from their new like shimmery glitter collection and I wasn't quite sure what to make of it at first because I thought oh, I was going to be quite see-through like especially I just didn't know like the material basically but I love these so much so I picked up a little scoop bralette so I haven't really well I've tried I think once and I think I got an extra large and obviously that was too small so I picked this up in a 2x it fits it fits great but it's still like more on the snug side but it's like a nice shimmery gold it is like double lime so we're not going to get any see-through issues which i was kind of worried about but yeah super stretchy it's just a little bit more tighter and then i got these style bottoms but they do have like a range of styles for you to choose from but they're quite high-waisted and they're a bit more cheeky they are like really thin super stretchy i got them in a 3x just to be on the safe side because I just wasn't sure and obviously if you want to send back on the skims website you have to pay postage so i just thought i'll go for a 3x and they fit fine um still loads of room on those and then i'll show you these ones because basically the bottoms were free for 36 pounds which makes them 12 pounds each so it's super cheap because i think they're like 20 pounds a pair otherwise um so i just picked up this color which is the bodysuit i have again super stretchy 3x um they are really thin but they're really soft like it feels like you're wearing nothing but yeah, that was, that's just like an odd one, basically. And then in the exact same set, I picked up a silver version because I do really like metallic kind of styles, especially like in swimwear and things like that. So I thought trying it in underwear would be quite nice. So yeah, 
shimmery. Again, we've got like the double lining on the inside. I got this in a 2X, um, just a bit more snug. I will need to adjust the straps though because they are like a bit like tight. And then I got the exact same bottoms that I got in the gold, in the silver, just because I liked the style of them. And this is more for like me wearing to bed and things as well. So I just wanted something comfy. So that's why I got that. And then my favorite bodysuit, which is the square neck ones, which I mentioned at the start, I had to pick it up in the silver. It's a fong style bottom. Um, and yeah, I really love it. It looks so nice on. It's not see-through either, but obviously if you're not wearing like nipple covers or anything like that, your nips will poke through and you'll see like that in, this, in that sense. But yeah, so cute, absolutely love them. Definitely snap them up if you like them, because they are so comfy. I wish they kind of had more like different colors in the shimmer, like a nice pink would have been. Or even like a really nice blue. So yeah, that's what I got from Skims. And then in this package, which I'm not gonna open because I'm saving it again for like a little TikTok review, is two bodysuits. I've got a green and a black one. They're supposed to be like dupes for the Skims. So I've got those to try and review. And because obviously I have, I don't have the shape from Skims that I'm trying from Amazon, but I will kind of know what they're like because I've got so many of the other bodysuits. And then in here we have something naughty. I basically have a credit card where you earn like points and then you can change those points into vouchers. So I've pretty much got this like half price because I changed my points into vouchers. Cause I didn't realize I actually have this and it's like one of my favorite scenes. That's what I got. Feels really light. Could be legit. I mean, they could have done a bit better on my face. So yeah, I'm gonna add that to my thing now. Right, this is the current state of the perfumes. So, this was my new little extra one I put in. So originally, obviously it was like that, which looks better because the center one's not being blocked. And then I put my diffusers up there because originally it was just the one in the middle and then the others at the side. So I'm thinking, where shall I put my Paris ones? Like the only thing I will say is that, obviously this little section kind of spores it, but then I don't really have anywhere else for my stuff to go unless I put it on the window ledge. Okay, right, this is what I've gone for. My sister thinks she can organise this better than me, but I was saying, like, I think I need, like, more matchy-matchy ones, you know? Like, obviously, I've got my three Nicki Minaj ones. They don't look too bad, because they're kind of, like, similar shape. Um, but, obviously, I've got my two matchy ones at the back, and then it's a shame that she doesn't do white, I don't think, or Victoria's Secret don't have a pink bottle like that, because it'd be more matchy, and then I could have one odd one in the middle. Um, obviously, that's more of a lighter pink, but I just kind of wanted it to have, like, the same layout as above, so I've kind of gone for that for now. I do really need to put another one of my coasters here, I think, to make it more matchy. I never showed you guys my little cute outfit. This is my little Adidas, or as the Americans say, Adidas. It's definitely Adidas, guys, sorry. Um, but yeah, it's just a little rib top and then some shorts. I feel like they've shrunk, or obviously I've just put on weight. So yeah, I've pretty much tidied my room. I'm gonna take off my makeup now because I don't really like having makeup on my skin anyway, but obviously it's probably gonna end up making me break out even more. Um, and then I just need to finish organizing. It's still raining now. I wanted to like bunch up all the recycling and that because we've got so much um, and we've got so much like rubbish as well. It's, I think I'm gonna watch a film now or chill or see if Benal wants to watch an episode of Raising Canaan, either or. Um, so yeah, I will pick up the camera guys in a bit. Okay, so we're a few hours later. I totally forgot to vlog, to be honest. Uh, I didn't vlog what I had for dinner. I literally just made like a tuna pasta. And my remaining parcel came. Just like got my Christmas stuff in that I wanted to make like my other garland thing with. But I will just, I think, put it all by in like my Christmas decks and just do it next year. Because honestly, the decks will be going down soon. So what is the point in putting them up now? I'll show you guys what I got. So I got a few more of the green velvet poncettas. I think there's another one in here somewhere. And then I got some of the red ones that I put in my wreath. Um, another red one. Oh, my battery's gonna die. Oh, two more red ones. I think I wasn't sure how many I would need. Another two more. The acorn berries that I put in the wreath as well because obviously I'm matching it with my garland. Only one pine cone. Oh, maybe they only had one left and I'd picked it up anyway because I was going to buy them from elsewhere. Let me yeah, so I only picked up one because that was all they had in stock. Maybe my garland would just have to be all red. I need some more green poncettas, but I was kind of hoping that the website would have them in the sale, but they don't. 
I didn't really want to pay three pound per one but I do need to obviously get some more green ones then and some gold acorns. I'm gonna have to charge my camera, but I'm really not doing anything else. I'm watching The Circle on Netflix. Yeah, that's all I've been doing, not much. Um, here is a little pumpkin, snoozing. He's so cute. So yeah, I will finish vlogging tomorrow. I don't really have any plans tomorrow. I, can't, I need to do some more content shooting, but yeah, I will update you guys in the morning. Good morning, guys. So it's the 29th of December. I have literally just got ready because I'm gonna shoot some content. I need to do the Skims little haul and the Amazon one. And then I'll probably take some pictures just because I've got nothing else to do really. So yeah, that's the current plan. Bernard's taking his parents back to the airport. So I've got some quiet time so I can do my stuff. Um, I'll probably try and go gym later. I haven't been in like 10 days, kind of giving my body a rest. I feel like it needs it, but yeah, I need to stop being lazy and get back into the gym. And that's kind of like all I have planned for now. So yeah, I'll show you guys some of the bits and bobs as I film. Right, I've just taken off the black one and I completely forgot to show you guys, but just imagine this in black as well. So this is the green bodysuit from Amazon. It don't fit like exceptionally well, like the Skims one, like proper glued to your body. There's a bit of wrinklage, but overall super impressed. I got it from a seller called Ria. I think it's like Rio Ria. Um, from that UK Amazon because a lot of people were buying ones from the American Amazon and you can buy them but obviously I thought I'll try these first because if they don't fit it's ag sending it back for the Amazon US one I think but yeah overall super impressed highly recommend I'll leave them linked down below if you guys want to check them out I wish they had some more styles and more colours um, obviously I picked green because it's the best and then black as well which is just handy but I do really like the shape as well so now I have like every shape bodysuit <laughs> Okay, so this is the Skims bodysuit. Sorry, but look at that. You guys know I love, if you watch like my hauls on my other channel, you know I love like metallic swimwear. And this isn't metallic at all, but obviously it gives that vibe. And I'm here for it, I'm living for it. I love it so much, if you can't tell. But um, yeah, I'm thinking, do I get the gold now? But I will show you the gold and silver on in a second. And then we can go from there but yeah I love that it's not see-through right I did again I took off the gold but I'm gonna put the gold back on anyway because I'm gonna try and create a TikTok but yeah this is what I picked up in the silver underwear again absolutely love it I'll get so much use out of it they're so comfy the bottoms feel like I've got nothing on so stretchy I definitely probably could have got a 2x but I'll probably just stick with a 3x anyway just because it gives more room and they're just like more comfy um but yeah I got this exact set in gold which I'll put on and show you guys if I don't forget guys i nearly forgot to show you the gold here's the gold so cute love it guys i'm just thinking should i start taking down some of my decorations but it's gonna make the house feel so plain but then i'm like i'm really getting in like that cleaning mood um but yeah anyways i just went and returned my fablex parcel because obviously i'm not keeping all the stuff i got myself a little baguette as well to have i mean what is the time Oh, it is nearly lunch, basically, so I'm going to eat that now. Uh, I think not. Look, 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 she knows. Yeah. Naughty girl, you naughty girl. <laughs> Skin's looking so much better when I put, like, makeup on. My breakouts are healing up, so that's good. Um, so, yeah, anyways, I was saying, I'm going to eat my lunch, which is literally my baguette, and then I might have a bit of cake. And yes, I will wait for Bernard to get back and then I think I'll go to the gym then just because he can take the space out the front. So yeah, I'm going to eat this, finish the last episode of The Circle and I'll catch up with you guys in a bit. I'm waiting for Bernard to get back and then I'm going to head to the gym because your girl needs to go. I think the last time I went was, my birthday was on the Sunday. Did I go on the Monday? I think it was like 19th, so like 10 days. So yeah, I really need to get back into the gym. I haven't really done much to be honest like I said I just well I had a phone call with my dad had lunch watched an episode of the circle and that was it good morning guys it's the last day of the year who's here oh hello guys we are currently shopping so I'll take you guys with me and show you anything that I buy so I'll see you in a bit never mind the state guys and me please because it's raining Bonjour. I feel like all hot and sticky you know yeah. um Right, we just finished our shopping. She didn't vlog anything for you guys. How annoyed are you? I'm in the <laughs> Yeah, because it was hard, like it was raining. I'm carrying like some massive ass paper chase bag. I will show you guys everything that um, we picked up when we get back because 
got it now. But yeah, this is why I didn't want to go shopping because I've spent more money, unnecessary money that I didn't need to spend. I think we got some bargains. Yeah, we did. Most of it was sale. Every, everything I bought was sale apart from Primark, but then I used my gift card. Exactly. Because I've got 20% off my shirt in H&M. So yeah, we're going to go TK Maxx and then we're going to be naughty and get McDonald's. We're not going to tell Bernard because we're supposed to be getting a takeaway later. But I've caved in. I said to her, no, I'm not having two takeaways. You do it every time. Oh, no, I think you could do that. You're my everything. And it goes with my red car. Anyways, right, let's drive. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> Listen to my chesty cough, guys. I'm still recovering. That's what happens when you're asthmatic. What's the way out? Bro! <laughs> what the? What are you doing? I've actually, nearly died. I've actually nearly died in her car several times today. She thinks she's some fucking rally car driver, but she's not. She's one of the worst drivers. You've Someone ever. isn't wearing their seatbelt. Yes, I'm putting it on. You're saying my driving's bad, you ain't. Yeah, but you're in a car park. Seat. You're supposed to drive five miles an hour and you're driving ten. Alright, I'm gonna go down. No, don't. Just get out of here. <laughs> <laughs> right, um, I will see you guys when we're in TK Maxx. I've got a voucher for there. Au revoir. Rate, rate Sprouts driving on a scale of oh, one to one. Six. Automated car was the best thing she ever did. <laughs> yeah, 100%. I never <laughs> back to manual. I don't want to not drive a manual because I feel like I'll forget how to drive it. But that's why Bernard doesn't ever want to go like Ireland and get a manual car because he feels like he won't know how to drive it. And I do not okay, want to be lumbered with driving in Ireland. Though. Right, guys, we're back. I want to show you all what I bought. Um, do you guys want to see Sprouts Cool Mug? It's like a little vase type pot, but she wasn't going to get it and I said you're going to regret not getting it. I am going to show you guys what I bought. So, I think before I showed you I got them really nice pasta bowls from TK Maxx. Anyways, they've got some more like ones in, so I got sunflower ones because obviously I like sunflowers and they were £5 each. And then guys, since I went shopping with my bestie and he bought basically the similar things, I wanted them for my bathroom so they suctioned onto the wall and then you can put your stuff in them and they were £7.99 each because I'm fed up of having everything on the like bar. Did you scare him? Why did he come running in? Oh, yeah, you know you're not allowed to do that, don't you? And then I picked this up. This is just to go on my window ledge just so I can pop all my stuff in. And that was £10. Bargain. And this is my cute little shirt. <laughs> From H&M. Really? Hello. Oh, I want to dance with somebody. Can you not traumatise my cats? Thank you. Loves me. So, yeah, I got that in a medium. Oh no. Oh, you had to ruin it. Um, medium from H&M. I got it for 15 instead of 20 with my like voucher code. And then sister copied me, but I really liked this. She copied me, bro. No, I found it first. I was there. I said, I nice found it Easter. first. Eight pounds. Really nice and soft. Do you guys want to see Pumpkin cleaning his winky? <laughs> <laughs> Look at this huge bag. And then we went to Paper Chase and everything in the Christmas was 50% off and then 50% off on top 50 of that. 50% off 50% guys. So it's 100% so you get it for free. No. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, she's going poo. Guys, Maple is doing a poopy. So I got these because I really wanted to do a Christmas cat theme for Sprouts. Christmas this year, but no, I didn't get to do he that. He desperately wants to get in the bag, Sue. Look. Hold on, hold on, hold on. So they were really cheap. There you go, Pumpkin. And then I got crap, cat Christmas paper to match. Got what? <laughs> crap. And then a cute little ballerina one, like some gingerbread one. And that's pretty much all I got. I don't know if Sprout will be bothered to show you what she got later, but um, yeah, now we're going to do the puzzle that we started doing on Christmas Day and gave up because the border just sent us into misery mode. Um, so yeah, this is the puzzle we're doing. A thousand pieces, and this is why the edging was really hard because it was literally just black and white. Today I bought a cat. <laughs> really, sis? Pretty oh, little baby, look, traumatised. Hey, <laughs> <laughs> See, traumatised. <laughs> So yeah, we're going to start that now and I'll give you an update in a bit. Guys, we should have um, looked at the time. We don't know how long this has taken us, but this was hard, like with the edging, because this side was wrong in his normal spot. That side had a few pieces wrong, but yeah, we've done it. Now to get on with the rest. 
Right guys, I haven't vlogged in a while because we've been rushing around. So I went to the post office, that was closed, didn't realise, so that's closed for a few days. Then I went to Asda, that was an absolute disaster, but I picked up my um, I mean, parcel that I've got to show you. But it was a disaster because there was like loads of people not. You it's just you. Yeah, it was really bad cute, everyone was waiting. Shout out to Asda stores. <laughs> So now we're going TK Maxx quickly because we booked Frankie's and Benny's, which is quite good, guys, because obviously I don't have to have chips and a burger again. I can have like spaghetti bolognese or something. Hot dog, but I'll probably get no, do a hot dog, sis. Be different. No, be different. So, yeah, so we're going TK Maxx now. And then it's Frankie's and Benny's. Right, we're back. We literally had our table booked at half five and our food, she ordered and it came within like two minutes, not even joking. Like, is Frankie's and Benny's all just microwaved food or something? Because why does it come so quick? Anyways, I've got my stuff that I'm going to show you guys from Asda. Right, we'll start off with the boring one because I don't know why they didn't do her face and they did her body. Oh shit, sis, they're actually really big. Got the Queen of Hearts. Yeah, I'll bring them in in a sec. Now the, and I'll show you the next one actually that I didn't, like wasn't overly fussed if I got him or not. White Rabbit. Like these are stuff that you're not going to get, so I don't think I will use these mugs to be fair because, like I said, they're not going to be mugs that you get often. And then this is the one I really wanted, Mad Hatter. Sorry, how sick is that? And then, they always have Cheshire Cat, Cheshire Cat ones. Alice, how cool guys. So you get a pack of four from Asda for £20, which is actually really cheap. Because obviously if you was getting that from Disney Store, that's about £20 per mug. And then I've got a set of free canisters because they're bringing out a load of like Alice stuff again. Because the other original Alice stuff must have done so well. So they're bringing out loads of new stuff. So yeah, these are the canisters I've got. I'm hoping to put them in my room or something or just keep them in storage for now. But they were three for like £12. I think they're just... Might just be glass, I'm not sure. So yeah, that was what I got. They are so cute. Hey guys, so we're back. I don't know if I've vlogged since, but yeah, I have vlogged since we come back. So we just had pancakes and I forgot to completely vlog that. So now we're watching Barbarian, but you know, you've got a nice screensaver. Sister's here, we've got the bed ready. So we're gonna sit here facing the TV and see how it goes. Because this was her idea. So yeah, yeah, we're gonna end out the good. vlog for today and I'll pick up the camera when it's the 1st of January, 2023, AKA 17 this days till Sprout's 30th birthday. 20, 21, <laughs> this is the last time you'll see us this year. Yeah. Say cheerio. Cheerio, Sproutlets. Cheerio. Good morning guys, happy new year. <laughs> I have decided to get up and start taking the decks down. This is my little the box that I got off of my decks, how good's that? Paper. Got one cat there, two cat there. Chucking shoes around. So yeah, that's the plan because we don't know what we're doing today. I've obviously just woken up, so. We go out. Go out where? Everything's closed. I'm not spending any more money. You already made me spend loads of my money yesterday. Oh, I didn't, Although I'm gonna get £14 back. We tried those suction things in my bathroom. Guys, just excuse what the hell I look like and they were shit, they don't work. They just don't work. And Bernard said we were being stupid about it and he couldn't even get them to work. Huh. So yeah, I'm just sort of doing that while, I don't know, Sprout sorts her life out. Mm -hmm. Look at all the Sprout stuff she's got to take back. Yes, Rob. Well, she's leaving me on the first day of the year. Excuse me, I came to see you. 17 days till you're 21. Yes. <laughs> on to you 58. <laughs> <laughs> I wore this some pumpkin and maple. Maple and pumpkin. Is it a, that's what you should wear on a gender reveal. Isn't it? Is it a boy or a girl? Sorry, where, are I don't know where, that is. where are your legs? Look. What? It goes do you days till twenty one. Right, say goodbye to the vlog. Oh you little rat. Hey. Bye guys, happy new year. Don't forget to like the video, thumbs up, have a thumbs down, subscribe, ring the bell. Ding a ling a ling. <laughs> and I'd say Happy New Year. I won't put him on camera, he won't like it. Oh, he's a loser. Peace out, dude. 
Guys, the tree is gone. Look at me, I'm a wreck. I didn't see the point in making myself look decent for the fact that I'm still doing chores and it's one o'clock. So I've been going since Sprout was here basically, but obviously like taking my time. Um, yeah, I've done quite a bit. I'm just gonna chill now. I'm gonna edit this vlog because obviously I wanna get it up for you guys today. So I'll have a vlog for New Year. I mean, I'm not really ending out great, but is what it is yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this vlog i won't bother doing all the spiel that sprout said so yeah i'll see you guys in the next vlog bye guys bye.